Good morning. Hi. Welcome with our new lesson of Kashmiri English Manual by Sayyid Hamid Bukhari, Sayyid Kausar Andrabi and Maryam Muhammad. Today, we'll introduce about or we'll talk about timing. So what's the time by your watch? How to say time in Kashmiri language? Till now, we introduced basic expressions, the shortcut formula for helping verbs and numbers up to 20. So this is based on numbers. If you are not aware about numbers, you cannot say time. So that's why we introduced first numbers up to 20. Then we are going to introduce timing. So we'll start our lesson. That is how to say time in Kashmiri language. First we'll make a clock. Let's make clock. For example, this is the clock. And we'll write here, this is 12 and this is 6. This is uh, 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, this is 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So let's mark them first. I'll write here. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. As you know, we have done the lesson on numbers. We call ak, 1, z, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now, let's listen how we can do this. This is very easy. With numbers in Kashmiri language, for example, you have to say, what's the time? First, in this part, we'll introduce only about hours, hourly timing. For example, you have to say, this is one o'clock, this is two o'clock, this is three o'clock. So you don't get confused. That's why we introduce first hourly timing. Then we'll introduce quarter, then quarter two, and that way we can do it. So, in this part, let's learn. We know ak, one is called ak, one is called ak. So, I'll write here ak, and then it's z, then it's tre. I will not write marks always. So, it's then sor, then it's pass. Then it's she. Then it's sat. Then it's earth. Then it's now. Then it's da. Now see. And then it's ka. Then it's ba. Now see. We'll first show you how to say this. Let's see. We have to add only if we say what's the time by your watch and you have to say this is one o'clock. This is one o'clock. You have to add only one thing there and that is, I would just say here the word that is baje. That is baje or sometimes we say baje ye. See how you have to say ak baje. When you will come to my home and you will say that I will come to your home or I am coming to your home at 1 o'clock. I am coming to your home by 1 o'clock or at 1 o'clock. So you have, you have to say bayim aki baje or bayim ak baje. Bayim ak baje. See, then you have to say ak baje means one o'clock, means one o'clock, then z baje, then tra baje, then suar baje, then paas baje, then sha baje, see, this is baje, then sat baje, earth baje, now baje, da baje, kah and ba. So this is timing. Now, sometimes we say that bayum ak baje. So we put a or a, a at both places here 
at the bottom here see I kill by J so you can say ah by J we am ah by J that's also way to say uh, right here ah by J ah by J or you can say ah by J or you can say I kill ba J then at that time you don't have to say k then you have to write like this i k b j i k b j i k b j i will come at 1 o'clock i will come at 1 o'clock so i will come at 2 o'clock b m z b j or d y we say sometimes d y b j d y b j so d y then b j i will come at 3 o'clock that means b m 3 b j or b m 3 y by j so that way also i will come at four o'clock bm tour by j or bm tour by j tour that means sometimes a uh, tour you cannot say here tour 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 or tour by j tour by j or pants by j pants so you can say it here tour by j and shay shay ye like this shay baje sat baje uth baje nai ye then you don't have to noun we nai ye baje da ye baje so you can put this also ye ye at separately i will show ye ye i ki baje i ki baje ye z baje tre baje ye See, sometimes we say by J -y. for example, tre by J -y. for example, what's the time by your uh, uh, clock? You say it's three o'clock, then you can say tre by J -y. so or by J -y. pass by J -y. shab by J -y. So when you have to say it's now five o'clock or six o'clock or twelve o'clock, then you have to say by J -y. So it changes the shape changes only in two or three uh, scenarios there. For example, now I will categorize sentences. For example, you have to say when you are going to eat food. I'm going to eat food at five o'clock. Bikam doye baje. Bikam bata doye baje. See ba je doye. That means we did not use that time. Doye baje. Doye baje. When you are going to eat food, I will. I am going to eat food at three o'clock. Bikham bata treye baje. Bikham bata suere baje. Bikham bata pointe baje. Now, what's the time by your clock? It is three o'clock. It is three o'clock. You can say simply tre baje. Tre baje or tre baje ye. Suar baje ye. So it's very simple. So what's the time? Kuts baje. So the lesson was exactly if you open the manual, the lesson was Kuts baje. Kuts baje ye. What's the time? What is the time? So you learned hourly timing. You learned hourly timing. That means 12 o'clock, bah baji, 1 o'clock, ak baji, 2 o'clock, 2 z baji, 3 o'clock, tra baji, 4 o'clock, tsuar baji, 5 o'clock, pans baji, 6 o'clock, sha baji, 7 o'clock, sat baji, 8 o'clock, ard baji, 9 o'clock, now baji, 10 o'clock, da baji, 11 o'clock, ka baji, 12 o'clock, it's bah baji. Now, let's introduce. Uh, quarter to this quarter past quarter past so in this part hourly and quarter past in our next there is quarter to and whenever you have to say it's five past six past 13 past or three quarters or 13 to five o'clock or something like that that will be next part but now we'll see quarter past let's rub it See, you have to add 
you have to add one word before numbers up to 12 for example your number is 1 2 ak z 3 4 5 6 7 8 now da so if i write here uh, ak z up to 5 i'll write 3 4 5 now what you have to add you have to say that it's quarter past one it's quarter past one quarter past two quarter past three so you have to add this one so the so the means I write here the transcription it's so then it's the or I will transcribe it Roman into like this it's O then here there is D for this then there is U that means U you know that's like this that's like this so it's SO D it's SO D that means this one you have to add what's the time by your clock and you can say it's one pa it's quarter past one this swad ak it's quarter past two swad z it's quarter past three swad tre it's quarter past four swad tsur it's quarter past pass uh, five swad pass it's quarter past six swad she swad she it's quarter past seven swad sat it's quarter past eight swad ert it's quarter past ten swad Da, so the da. That means you can increase up to twelve. Means if you have to say quarter past, you have to say swa the. You have to say swa the. So let's do exercise first. So let's do exercise. When you are going to come, I will come at uh, quarter past one. That means bium swa the. I am going to eat at quarter past one. Bium swa the. I can. I am going to offer my prayers at quarter past two. Means, bekhama, bupare namaz swadi dai. I am going to offer my prayers at four o'clock. Bupar namaz swari baj. So mixed. I am going to offer my prayers at five o'clock. Bupare swari baj. Hamid is Hamid is going to America at five o'clock. Hamid gets America, Pansi Baj. Hamid is going to Makkah at 6 o'clock. Hamid gets Makkah Shay Baj. Hamid is coming to home. Hamid is coming home, sorry. Hamid is coming home at quarter past one. Hamid is Swadi Aki Gar. Hamid is going to school at quarter past ten. Means Hamid gets school Swadi Dahi. So this way you have to introduce two things today. One, you learned hourly timing and the timing that's quarter past called swad and hourly timing you have to first write numbers in hourly timing then you have to say baje then I said different dimensions of it how you have to modulate then uh, so in our next part we learn about uh, that is uh, half past and quarter to quarter to and numbers then for example 35 to in our next part so be attentive and join our next part but do not neglect to subscribe our videos on YouTube and write us you can note my address B U K H A R I H A M I D 786 at the rate of gmail.com so see you in our next lecture till then goodbye